Hello. Hello. Hey, we're back. Um, players yeah. disconnected. It's Dawson and Maxwell. Uh, we played this game a while ago. Well, okay. So the first time we played it, what happened? Well, before we were like, we heard this is the greatest board game of board games. Actually, yeah. You and I went to the store. Oh man. And uh, so you were like, oh, this is like the number one rated game. And you pointed at it, and I picked it up. And I, I remember just picking up the box and being like. This feels like a fucking amazing game, <laughs> and I like loved the art design, yeah. and I was like, "Shit, I gotta oh, own this and game." The his historicity of it. Oh yeah, yeah. As yeah. as as a history major, it kind of hit me right in the fucking knowledge lumps. <laughs> um, so after buying it and spending with six hours waiting through the rules, yeah, we well, yeah, well, actually, I don't think we touched it for a while. I think I bought it because I, I you bought played, it. You played with your folks, didn't you? No, no, no. I never played it until I played it with you. And I, because I bought it in. No, remember, you, you weren't there when I bought it. Okay, well, but I I bought it and had it at uh, the X's in my place, and uh, I had poured over it and looked for online tutorials. And then you and I were like, "We're gonna play it. Mm -hmm. We're gonna sit down and play it." We went out and like bought pizza and no, no, beer. We got, we got a few turns in. Yeah, we played a couple turns. Where like, we're like, you know, "This is really good." Like we were really getting into it, and we're like, "Oh man, this is gonna be great." Let's go get some dinner, and we'll come back, and we'll put four more hours into it. Yeah, it's going to be amazing. On all late night fucking gaming fest. And and then Dawson... Uh, lost immediately. Yeah, he after. fucking <laughs> initiated nuclear war. And everything <laughs> went to hell. On accident. But it Not was, deliberate. It was like, oh, shit. And then I played it with my dad. And then we haven't touched it I in remember a while. your victory was so deflating. I was, I, yeah, I was like, <laughs> so, so much wind out of our sails. We were like, we're going to have a good time playing... So those of you who don't know, uh, this is Twilight Struggle. This is uh, how would you describe this as far as like? Um, th well, it's the number one number one rated game last I checked on Board Game Geek. So if you're not familiar with the website, the title should tell you a lot <laughs> about why this game would be rated. As you can see, it's very much almost a sort of Excel spreadsheet thrown on a rough. Uh, Nolan esque map. There's not a lot of chance in this game. Nope this this little guy. And that little guy come in very rarely. Not only do they come in rarely, but they're well, like, it's hard to win with them, because you you're already stacked in a way yeah. that it's. This is just sort of a, okay, well we didn't have another mechanic to fucking sort this out. Yeah, I, f the, I feel like the draw deck affects more, much more how the game goes. And actually, than... okay, so this game Twilight Struggle is based on the Cold War. So, like, it is, as we discussed uh, earlier, it is slighted in the American favor. I'll be playing America. Dawson will be playing the USSR. Because, historically, America won the Cold War. And I lost last game, so... And my dad playing the USSR <laughs> lost last game as well. But that was actually not because of the game. Um, it has... Okay, so oh, this, I meant I lost the last game of Netrunner. But as as you can see up there, the, uh, the board... Or the game goes in three phases, basic or three sections. I don't know how to put it. Goes it goes by the presidents. It, yeah, <laughs> it's early war, uh, mid, mid war, war correct. late war. Correct. Um, so there's three whole sections. They've got turns, phases. This is a phase, I believe. Each one of those is a turn uh, for the presidents or the uh, Gorbachevs, and then uh, there's actions in the turn. And it's just broken down fucking... It's. I don't know why more people don't play Euro games, because they are literal. You can... If you're doing it right, you cannot fuck it up. Like Well, you can. The, well, I, 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 I attribute that to translation errors. Okay. <laughs> but for the most part, they're so structured that mm -hmm. as long as you're following the rules, you will succeed. Uh, oh, wait. You're going to... I handed you one of these. and then Did I hand it back to you? I think you did. That was quite silly. Uh, these are like your quick guides for when I'm being your, a dumb baby diaper. Your quick guide. Yeah, that that is the quick guide. <laughs> the quick guide. And not only that, but it comes with the back. That back is the card In list. Case and this card to... confuses the hell out of you. Yeah, yeah. hey, here's you, the, the page you, that explains you it. You need to find the very specific page. In the zero book. Mm -hmm. um, okay, first thing that I forgot to look up is how many cards we deal to each other. I'm just amazed at like you know the ten dollar Microsoft Word job that they did putting this thing together. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, uh, I don't know if you remember, but I basically printed out the space battle thing within like ten minutes. That's like they probably just went down to FedEx <laughs> Express and had no, this printed out. No. <clears throat> um, 
Okay, so I'm trying to figure out how many cards I deal. How many? Cards uh, it I is deal? seven to each player. Seven to I each player. I just read that somewhere. You read it somewhere. I did. That yeah, is set up. A... Nope, right here. Eight early war cards to each player. Okay. The china card. So I guess we'll have to find that or reshuffle I'm, those. I'm going to shuffle this once. And then I'll have to be... Well, we got to pull. The... I shuffled it several times. We have to oh, pull the china card out. Hold the china card. The china card. That's you our start special off china. Far more influential than I. Oh yeah. USSR get fifteen influence markers. You get twenty five. I think rack it up to the fact that the uh, USSR was pretty fucking broke at the end of World War Two. We are very ambitious people. Okay, and then uh, will you cut that for me just to keep me honest? Oh, the China card. And you start with that, right? Uh, yes, I do. All I right. mean, I don't. You, we know you start with it. It's in the rules. You might have forgotten. That should be eight. Double check for me. Bleep. Four, eight. That's how many I have. Yeah. Well, I have nine. Nine it is. Or because of the China card. Unless that is supposed to... Is that clear? That's not clear. No, I think that's clear. Eight early war, eight early war cards each player and China card to the USSR. So, okay. That makes sense. So All right, yes. now I can't remember... Uh, uh, if you start or I start. I think I start. I would like to think that I, the bad guy, start. Um, but uh, let's, let's take but it. it's one of these games, so to the rule book. Yeah, to the rule book. Let's see. Uh, set up. Hold on. Oh, yep. I get a bunch of you. Okay, that's not in there. We covered the initial yeah. influence. Yep. So we, we figured we figured those rules out. Yeah. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Thirty minutes later. Um, uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Even after playing the game, we still struggle. In our credit, it was like a year ago that we played. Oh yeah. Yeah yeah. Um. Okay, so the headline. Oh, you're adjusting. Your yeah, mic. I'm adjusting my mic. It's these are not good boom stands because I'm poor. <laughs> All right, so headline phase, right? Mm -hmm. Headline phase. Hmm don't like that. Hmm. All right, so I'm going to, this is mine for the headline phase. Knocking my mic around. Sorry, guys. Dun 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 Um. Well, playable. I thought I knew what I was doing. Then I realized I read my card wrong. So oh no! That's so dumb. Don't worry. Um, I'm not. Not exactly. Oh man. Why not? Are you we'll ready? Are yes. You ready? Are you ready? All right. So for my headline phase, I have chosen captured Nazi scientist. I get to advance my space race marker one box, but I only have operation value of one. So what's yours? Mine is Warsaw Pact formed. I remove all U.S. influence from four countries in Europe, or add five USSR influence. Um, uh, in Eastern Europe, allowing no more than two per country. Um, so we're going to do the second one because you have no presence in Eastern Europe. So, mm -hmm. and you've got three, so that goes first. Yep. So go ahead and do that. Okay. So you're adding five. I'm going to add uh, two, two, Czechoslovakia is no longer a country, isn't it? That's I don't know. Not true. I don't think it is. Uh, probably not. Because it's a Czech Republic now. Um, I'm going to add two to Bulgaria. 
Okay. And you have one more. One more to add it to Eastern Germany. All right. Since that was an event and it has a, an asterisk on it, that means it goes in the we're done. Forever. Forever. And so is mine. But if you would be so kind as to move my space race marker. I would. One. What's it? I am the U.S. It says sir. It says I get uh, the NASA one. I, but mine is more in line with the color background here, or just color matching it. It's two ops roll one to three. <laughs> Excuse me. Don't remember what that means. Oh, the, well, the ops roll. Uh, it requires two ops <clears throat> to move to that spot, and I have to roll a one to three twice to get. No, I have to roll between a one and a three to actually secure that spot. Remember to move. The other thing you can do with your uh, with your operations points yes. is you can try to advance the space race. Mm. So I'd need two ops. To but do so that. far, your Sputnik is getting into space first. Yeah, well, yeah. And I was trying to see what that one is. I, okay. It's two vice one. I can't. This is where those. Uh, so two something. That's where this matters. So, like, I got the first. Wait, do you actually have... Oh, no, there it is. I think... Oh, sorry. My no, bad. no worries. Uh, I think that means... I think I get two victory points for reaching that, and you get one when you reach it. Okay. That sounds pretty, correct. Pretty sure. <clears throat> All right, and then I play seven cards. You're... Yes, you're going to play seven cards. Okay. I'm pretty sure. I don't think we back and forth it. I don't think so either. Um... Then, uh... But hand me the rule book. I'll look at that real quick while you're fucking up the I'm, game for everybody. Stop it. I'm pretty sure I, I use all my actions. Yeah, I think you do too. Oh, wait. Hold on. Uh, it's It goes back and forth. It does? Yeah, if you go to the uh, examples of play, it's action round one for you, action round one for me, action oh, round one for you, kay. action round one for me. Very good. Um, I, I was going to say, if you used them all in a row, that would add no like intrigue to the game yeah, at all. Uh, that would, yeah. So, okay. Sorry, guys, we haven't played this game a lot. Right. Um, then I'm just going to... <clears throat> Kick the door down, as it were. Oh yeah. With is, a uh, is that what we're doing here? The China card. Oh, we're well, we're China carding. Uh, and can I use influence to remove yours? No, no. You're saying like it's a realignment roll to reduce. Yeah, a realignment roll to reduce it, a coup to reduce it and give you some. Okay. Or you just have to use more than me. I'm just gonna go ahead. And, and you you're using the China card as the China card. Or are you using it as an operation? As, I'm pretty sure, yes, operation. Okay, so, okay, so this is that, this is where that uh, whole section for just the yep, China card. I'm just going to just go past to you at the end of this yeah, turn. Yeah, it goes face down to me. So I get five operations points? You get four. Uh, wait, plus hold one. on. It has a plus one value in there. Oh, are you going to use them all in yes, Asia? Yes, plus one if used in Asia. Yes. Will. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I'm just going to plorp five down right here. Mm -hmm. So yeah, this goes face down to me. Mm -hmm. And you just plorped five? Yep. Where'd you plorp them? Right there? Okay. Yep. Now I know. You son of a bitch. Just My mother was married. <laughs> kicking in the door. Uh, it still is. He's reading the manual. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm looking at the... Just trying to make sure. All right. So, now it's... That was your first action, right? Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, for the record, the China card starts with the USSR, and uh, he got plus one for using all the operations so points. So, there is an operation value four. I added one, so I just used one, two, three, four, five here to add five to South Korea, thus controlling South Korea. Absolutely. Me. No more Gangnam Style. <laughs> uh, see, I'm going to I'm going to use this as an event. It is Truman Doctrine, and what it does is it removes all USSR influence from one country in that is uncontrolled in Europe. So, 
since you don't control this, I'm going to give you that back. Well, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. And that was mine. Okay. Ta -da -ta -da -ta -da. Well. <clears throat> well. Okay. Yeah. Is that what we're doing? Is that what we're paying? I'm going to score Asia. Oh, wait. Hold on. There's that. It doesn't really matter since we, but uh, let's see. So that was the second, your second action, right? Correct. Okay, good. You're going to score Asia? Yep. Yeah, all right. So So I, because I control more countries and more battleground countries, I dominate it. Uh, um, okay. Which means I get where, seven victory points. And you have a presence. Yep, I get. So you get three. I get three. So, so the one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yay! All right, so that's what you did? That's correct. That's your thing? Mm -hmm. that's, that's how we're rolling? Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm and going. To, oh. Out he goes? Or does it get reshuffled? Uh, did you use it as an event? Well, you have oh, to. Oh, yeah, no, it doesn't. Yeah, no, it's not. It goes in the discard pile because it doesn't have an asterisk, and the scoring cards are forever, forever. Okay. I am going to. Uh, <coughs> I am going to use Comic Con, <laughs> but not the good kind. <laughs> the uh, communist, the the Council for Mutual Economic Assistance, the antithesis of the Truman Doctrine. Um, which gives me, or which I'm going to use, since it's your card. For operation. I'm using it for our three operation points. And y the event that happens is add one USSR influence to each of four non-US controlled uh, countries in Eastern Europe. Now, since it's your event, I get, I get to decide whether yeah. it happens before or after I oh. do my control. And I'm going to say you get to place your, your uh, one in each before. I you do it. Okay. So as long as I don't control it and it's in Eastern Europe. And Austria counts as both? Yes. Austria case. and Finland are both. Alright. Um, so let's go ahead and raise add two more. If we're going to raise Eastern Germany to five. You can't. You have to do one. So you can raise it to four. It's, Ooh, it's, at, it's at four. Oh, okay. You, so I thought you said two more. I'm raising it to five. Yeah, yeah. I uh, thought you were saying I'm using two to raise right. it. Right. And then I'm going to use my last one to control Bulgaria. Cool beans. Uh, You're going to cool Bulgaria. I get three. Mm -hmm. So for my points, for my three points, what I'm going to do is let's see I am going to control Iran uh, give me that one back I am going to er, I'm going to you have two more uh, yeah I do I'm gonna control Lebanon okay. and then for my last one I am going to and knock you off that high horse and put one in Poland. Uh, that would cost you two because I can. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, you can. Sorry. Might be, might be, might be. Sorry, <laughs> jumping the gun. Jumping the gun. Well, fine. It's going to be a fucking race in Austria then. <laughs> the 1 1 race. 1 1. Um, okay. I am going to uh, play nuclear test ban. Oh no! For operations value. Okay. Well, uh, a four. I think it's four. Isn't it? Yeah, you get four. It doesn't get discarded. No, because it doesn't have an asterisk. So why did ah? Okay. Okay. Groovy. It doesn't have an asterisk, and because <coughs> you can use it, mm -hmm. and you didn't use it as an event. Oh. So, like, y unless you want nuclear test ban to happen, you get that, right? 
Yeah, like, no, I there was something I was missing, which oh. was my fault. So okay. you, uh, I'm just going to keep roll with what I have. So you're using it um, for operations. I w wanted to do a coup there, but you have to have an influence. Oh, no, no, you, no, you, you just have to influence. Yeah, you're so good. So we're going to do it. We're going to coup gonna, Italy. going to coup um, Italy. So which is going to raise the DEF CON, or degrade it, excuse me. Uh, yes, because it's a battleground country, yep. right? Okay, so I got that. Um, and then I have, I'm rolling against four. You, you're, yeah, you're rolling against four. I, but that has a value of four. Yeah, so, so you, so that negates it. So if I don't roll one, then good on me. Then good on you, <laughs> And, oh, oh. That's a six. I'll count that. Could have done better. You get, I take away two, and you get four. Okay. You I'm dick. There. All right. That's fine. That's fine. And that's your action, isn't it? Yes. That is my turn. All right. So, uh... Uh, we should be it. Oh, yeah. I have three, I believe. Yeah. This is my third one. <clears throat> I'm bad at that. I just remember it, you know? Uh, okay. So... Da -da 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 I am going to... I am going to Middle East scoring, which uh, <laughs> good choice, which makes me I you dominate. You get five. It. I have no presence, so you, very. You have presence. Nope, I don't control anything. You don't. Mm. I don't think. Do you need to control yep, presence? You need to control at least one country. Oh, okay. So, so I get five. Well done. Um, and that's now you're up. Okay. Well, I will. Uh. Score Europe. Hmm. Smart. So I dominate Europe right now. You have presence, so you get three. One, two, three. And then back one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Cool. Cool. Alright. That doesn't go in there then. But it goes in the discard pile. That's the out of play forever pile. But this one doesn't have an asterisk, Max. So it goes in the discard <laughs> pile. I I'm sorry. I, I know what you really, really wanted to do. I really wanted to to do that, yes. Hmm. Second soda time. Hmm. I am going to... I am going to play... Ooh. Let's see. For operations, mm -hmm. I'm going to play the uh, I'm going to play the Romanian abdication card, which is a U card. It removes all US influence to Romania and you gain USSR, you gain control of Romania. Oh, well, but thank you. I get an operation point. It's and I'm going to use that operation point to uh coup oh uh, man let's see i'm gonna what am i gonna coup i'm gonna cute i'm gonna coup syria no don't it's super easy i i'm not here for easy oh so <clears throat> will so keep to yourself with the fucking advice i'm i'm gonna coup oh god what am i gonna coup i'm going to coup uh Yugoslavia. Okay. So I'm rolling against the six. I have a plus one. Yeah. All right. Nothing happens. <laughs> but I still did a thing. Oh, and oh. you you did four, right? Mm hmm So I did a thing. Um, Defcon status does not degrade. Will? <laughs> I, I feel like that was a stupid card to play. I'm sure the internet will harangue me for it. I'm fine with this. Feel free to harangue the internet. I need it. Jeez.
Okay. Um, it's a bad combo, Dyson. I think he had a two was a great combo. Um, yeah, I'm not really liking my cards. I didn't get one. I have a couple that I'm like, why would I ever want to use that? And the worst yeah. part. The worst part is, is uh, you're gonna have to, you know, because yep. you can yeah. only keep one. Exactly. Um, so and actually, you're gonna end up keeping two because of the China, the China card. card. Groovy. Oh, true. So we should be on. Yeah, we're good. We're good. This is your fourth. We be on. I don't know. I know that. I know that when I'm done two cards, we'll be good. Yeah. That when, we I, when I you when I have one left, we're <laughs> over. Okay. Uh, we're bad at and this. I'm going to play. Shh. Um, uh, it's tense here. Twilight struggle. Yeah. Dawson okay. Tries I'm going to gonna use four motion revolution. Okay. Um, what is it? I can't see it. You're holding it oh, to nobody. Sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> right, uh -huh. Okay, what does it do? So uh, I'm going to use it for operations, obviously. Of course. Um, and uh, Taiwan shall be treated as a battleground country for scoring purposes only. If U.S. controls Taiwan when Asia scoring card is played or during final scoring at the end of the 10 turn. Taiwan is not a battle battleground country for any other game purpose. So you get to use it as a battleground country for scoring purposes. Okay. Um, that's two value, and I'm just going to dump those. Learn my lesson into Iraq. All right, uh, so it's my turn. Mm -hmm. I am going to. I'm going to Indo Pakistani war. Uh, India or Pakistan invades the other player, the other. Uh, I get to choose. Roll one die and subtract one for every opponent controlled country adjacent to the uh, target of the invasion uh, there are no targets yeah. or there there are none uh, so I'm actually gonna go for India it is gonna be the one invaded so yeah player adds two to the uh, victory on wait hold on wait a second hold on roll one die and subtract or Player on modified, oh. Player victory on a modified die of four. To, so if I roll between a four and a six, I win. Mm, that's and cute. I have terrible dice. <clears throat> um, okay, so nothing, nothing exciting happens. Okay. And that event did not have an asterisk. The first one, the discard pile. Okay. Um, <clears throat> that was also a dumb choice. Mm. Don't worry, Internet. Don't worry. Mm. Uh, I'm going to use this tournament here. De Gaulle. Leads France. Yep. Uh, as for an event? Operations. So if I used an event, it would let me remove two U.S. influence from France and add one USSR. There's nothing um, there to lose. So, yeah. Yeah. So one USSR influence for three. Three operation points, I think, is a good trade. Yeah. Um, and I'm going to put them. Where are you putting them? That's new for me. Which one? Those I'm just trying to remember the ones that were new for me at the start oh, of the okay. turn. So what I can't go off of. Um, uh, I think put one in East Germany, so two more. I did control Yugoslavia, so those two are going to go to Greece. No. The other two are going to go to Afghanistan. Cool. Is that it? That is it. All right. So for my last mm. card, because we're here now, 
Uh, for my last card, I am playing pa Arab Israeli War for operations points because it's your card. So uh, what's going to happen is I am going to use the Arab Israeli War card as a uh, let's see. I am going to use it for influence. I think I get two, and I'm going to. Use one on Israel. Doot. I'm going to take the w one excess that I have, and I'm going to put it into Panama. Uh, 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 uh. Good choice. Now, what was the effect of the event? Uh, you roll roll a dice, roll a six-sided dice, uh, and minus one for every controlled country by me that's adjacent to so Israel. So Lebanon. And yeah, so minus that if you get. A four through a six on a modified dice, you get two to the uh, track and some victory points and shit. Two to the military operation. Yeah, operation. Okay. Four. I think that's minus one to would three. Be three. So nothing. So yeah, no victory. Zero victory. All right. All right. So that is turn one. So okay, action rounds. Check the military operation status needs to be uh, greater than, or needs to be equal to or greater than the DEF CON number. I did not meet that standard, so you get three victory points. Oops. Oh, to four. And then uh, this goes back to zero. Uh, reveal the held card in tournament mode only, but uh, that's what I held on to. Just, I'm keeping oh. myself honest. And those are mine. I'd say what they were, but that would be nonsense. Yeah, that'd be silly. Uh, and then flip the China card. So I get this now. Well done. And then we advance the turn marker. Dun 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 dun. dun. And that would be uh, that'd be the end of turn one for Twilight Struggle. That's that's a twenty minute turn. Was I just that a twenty minute turn? Twenty ish. Let's do two turns per. No, just one? Yeah, just one. Okay. We'll just do one for now. Twilight Struggle, if, turn one. <laughs> that one was just long enough. Like, maybe okay. if we start, if we streamline, maybe we'll fit two in, but this time it'll just yeah. be a, a one turn, because our intro, you know, it gives us a couple minutes. Yeah. You know? And for any viewers who played this before, we're pretty new, so if you know the tips of the trade, please yeah, put feel in the free comments to, below. Feel free to drop some knowledge on us. Uh, Someone definitely did that for us on our first Risk Legacy game. <laughs> so, no big. Yep. Anyways, we will uh, catch you guys on the next turn. Yeah. Thank you, Mike.